All right, guys, welcome back to Tabs, the Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. This is the open alpha version currently available, and we are going to do some sandbox battles today, most notably a Clone Wars battle, the Order 66, with uh, Jedi Knights and Masters versus the Dark Jedi, Anakin Skywalker, and Clone Troopers. And we'll do that in a minute, but first... I want to show you guys some footage that Landfall Games, the developer, has uploaded over the past couple of days that uh, shows off the new Neon faction coming down the pike. So let's roll that footage, we'll take a look at that, and then we'll get into our custom battle. So here we go, roll them! Alright guys, here we go. The Neon faction in action. We have lightsabers, um, gravity bombers, and laser gunners there in the back. And here goes the gravity bomb, it's been detonated. <laughs> it sucks all the local enemies in. Knocks him down. I don't know if it does any damage to them or not, but it doesn't matter because you've got the, uh, the lightsabers right there to cut them down to pieces. And we've got the laser gunners over here firing their little 2x4s <laughs> that sound like gunpowder firearms. But, uh, yeah, my guess is those are just temporary placeholder models and sounds. They will be replaced with real laser gun looking things and sounding things so very very cool i'm excited about that let's watch it one more time here comes the barbarian horde charging the neon faction have they have no idea what's oh, what is that wall here we go oh <laughs> didn't see that coming yeah see some of them try to get right back up and then they get slaughtered i can't wait for these lightsaber battles man we're going to be able to do real Star Wars scenarios. It's going to be fantastic. And there they go. They're no match for laser gun and lightsabers for sure. A lot of friendly fire in there though, huh? Oops. <laughs> so in this video, we have another Neon Faction unit. And this one is called the Anti-Projectile Tower. So watch what happens here. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? So the archers are firing at the towers. And the towers are firing back at the projectile. Not necessarily at the... Oh, okay, now they're shooting the troops. Okay. <laughs> at first, I thought they were just targeting the projectile, but they're like, you know what? You shoot at me, I shoot back at you. So that is awesome. These are like surface-to-air missile defensive towers. So let's see what this guy does. One guy left. One little musket man is like, I don't know, should I shoot? I think as soon as he shoots, he's dead. See, I don't know if they're firing on him just standing there, or what are they waiting for? Shoot! Yeah, maybe they, they just take a while to reload or something. I don't know. <laughs> but that's amazing. The Neon Faction is just OP, obviously. But they're going to be a lot of fun. I like that we're getting into more um, futuristic and sci-fi type weapons. Now, I want to try to see right here. Are they shooting the musket ball? Because it doesn't look like the musket's firing. No, they just shot him. Shot him in cold blood. Well, he deserved it. All right, guys, now that we have seen what's coming down the pike in the Neon Faction, including laser guns, lightsabers, and anti-projectile platforms, <laughs> I think it's time now to get into the viewer suggestions. And uh, we have a perfect, perfect, and appropriate scenario put up by... Let's bring that right up on screen right now. There we go. Two people have suggested this. Order 66 by uh, Palpatine. So this is a Star Wars battle and the best that we can do right now is, as suggested, footmen for regular um, Padawans. Let's put some of those down. We're gonna have Padawans on the left and how many Padawans we're we looking at here? Let's do, yeah, 15 should do. Let's put them right in the center here. Five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 Padawans will lead the charge. And we're fighting on Hoth, of course, the snowy planet. Now let's add our Jedi and Jedi Masters. So the Jedi are, we're the regular samurai, right? So these are our Jedi. Uh, Jedi. We're going to scatter them around the map. And how many do we call for here? Fitty. Fitty Jedi. This is going to be a huge battle. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 48, 49, 50. Good thing I can count to 50. That would have been very embarrassing if I could not. And finally, our Jedi Master. We're only going to put five of these, right? Yeah, so five will scatter them in the back of the map. Uh, we have Yoda, of course, in the center. We have Mace Windu, Plo Koon, 
Uh, who else do we have? Um, oh, Obi-Wan Kenobi, of course. Can't forget him. And Kid Fisto. <laughs> Those are the only ones I really remember. <laughs> All right, that's excellent. Now we do the uh, the Evil Empire side, and we, of course, have Anakin Skywalker, the Jedi Master, the Dark Jedi Master there. And now we want 50 clones with muskets. <laughs> Pretty soon these will be real laser rifles, which would be awesome. I cannot wait. But let's just scatter these guys around in units of, let's say, five apiece, right? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Fifty. Fifty clones and Anakin Skywalker, the Dark Jedi, against five Jedi Masters, fifty regular Jedi, and fifteen Padawan. So I think we're ready. It's pretty close to even here, too. Not too bad. Heavy impact. That won't be a problem. Let's click on start and let us go. There go the Padawans charging. Poor little Padawans. <laughs> but we need some fodder up front anyway, so they're going to work out well. Oh, there we go. Oh, Jedi Master over here. Oh, that's, uh, oh, it's Anakin. He's slicing up the, the Padawans. Look at him go. Slicing up Padawans and, oh, now he's in the Jedi. And the Jedi got him, I think. Get him, Jedi. Jedi. Oh, they did. All right, Anakin's down, thankfully. What do we have over here? Oh, no. Oh, no. Obi-Wan! He got shot off off. Oh, man. The Jedi getting slaughtered. Come on. Oh, did you get a Jedi? Oh, Yoda. Yoda. There goes Yoda. Flipping, flopping, spinning, and stabbing. Nice, Yoda. You can't kill Yoda, you fools. Oh, we did it. Who's this? Mace Windu. It's Yoda, Windu. Oh, another Jedi Master. Oh, no, he's taking fire. Come on, guys, charge. Man, this is a really close battle. I like it. Oh, oh, man, Kit Fisto down. No, Kit Fisto. Oh, it's, they're too much for us, those, those laser guns. <laughs> Come on, guys, you have to run. Oh, no. Mace, get up, Mace. Come on, Mace, you can do it. Yoda's in. Yoda's in there, the troops. Yoda slicing and a dicing. And oh no, Yoda <laughs> one of his own. Mace Windu, you're our only hope, Mace. Get up. Wait, Mace dropped his lightsaber. Oh gosh. Oh, he's still okay. <laughs> Pick up a weapon. Come on, Mace, you can do it. Oh, headshot to Mace Windu. He's down and it's over. Wow, what a slaughter. That was actually pretty close. Okay, um, let's try that again, because that was really close. And I think what we might do is add, let's just add a few more Padawans. We have 15 Padawan. Let's add another 15 Padawan. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. That might even the score a little bit. I think once the, uh, once the Jedi get in there, they can do a number on these, um, these clone troopers. All right, here we go. Oh, these guys make it around that rock pretty quick. I want to go over here to this fight. We got the Padawans coming in. Clone troopers are shooting. I hear slicing, stabbing. Come on, Jedi. We got, uh, who's this? This is Kid Fisto over here in the back. Yeah, oh, no, look it. It's Anakin slicing all the Jedi up. Oh, the regular Jedi. Hopefully he doesn't get shot by his own clone troopers. Oh, man. Who was, was that uh, Mace? Mace took out Anakin. Should have in the movie. He had a chance too. Should have done it when he had his chance. Guys, you're on the same team. Same team. There we go. Oh, this was much better. Those extra Padawan really helped. Oh, we've got one clone trooper left hiding behind a rock. And two Jedi Masters. Oh, we got him. Obi Wan. Nice. All right. Well, that was pretty slick. Um, now it's a little bit skewed toward the Jedi. So how about if we add a few more shooters over here? Let's get another squad of muskets. No, let's not do that. Let's give... We're going to give Anakin a little help here. We're going to give him Dooku. He's going to be over here. And Darth Sidious himself. Emperor Palpatine. Let's do it. Here we go. Charge, Padawan. Charge. This is what you're good for. Yes, take the first shots. It takes a while to reload those muskets. You just have to get in, the, in those ranks. Let's go check in on uh, the Dark Jedi here. Oh, here's one here. That Anakin. Slicing and he's the Dyson. 
Oh, he's taking down multiple guys. You gotta take down Anakin. Look at him go. Don't let him use his force. That's right. Stab. Cut. And I think Anakin's down. Anakin's down! Good work. Any other Dark Jedi still up? I think... Where's Pal... Oh, here's a um, Jedi Master running around. Oh, no. You're all alone. It's Plo Koon. Come on, Plo Koon. Jump! Use your ninja... Yes, there we go, ninja. <laughs> use, use your Jedi powers, I mean. Oh, he doesn't have a weapon. You can still kick. It's not over yet. Kick him. In the face. Hurry. Oh. Oh, nice. Left hook. You got him down. Oh, low blow. Carry him with you. That's right. Use that body as a shield. Oh, my gosh. I don't know, Plo Koon. Oh, you got some support coming from the other side, Plo Koon. Hold on, buddy. And they have weapons. Here they come. All the Jedi Masters leaping and jumping. Red victory. <laughs> We went again! Alright, that's two! Two victories for the Jedi, and the clones have won. Okay, it's now time for a small battle. We'll do a big battle after this one, but this was suggested by... Hey, let me pop it up, because <laughs> I don't remember the names. So right here, and I can't believe we're going here. Fred versus Fred. Fred and his evil twin. Let's get Fred out here. Fred, of course, is, uh, well, he's a spear thrower. He started out as a spear thrower, but sometimes he's pretty multi-talented here. He can do a lot of things. But for right now, we're going to go with Fred versus Fred, spear versus spear, blue versus red. Have that. Let's see. Let's go, Fred. We're with you, buddy. You got to defend Denmark from your evil twin. He's coming to take the throne. That's right. He is. That's That was a rumor, anyway. I don't know. I know he's your brother. Doesn't matter. Throw your spear. Good one, Fred. <laughs> okay. Fred wins the day. Let's try again. Come on, Fred. We got you know what you know you know what you gotta do here. It doesn't matter if he's blood. Blood is not thicker than water. Just pretend today that he's an enemy. Throw it a spear, man! Nice one! <laughs> Alright, well Fred wins. Let's do uh let's do one more. Let's see. Let's go best out of five. Let's go watch evil Fred. Let's see what why what's what's why are you failing? I mean you guys you come from the you cut from the same cloth here. <laughs> they stare at each other that nobody wants to throw. Oh wait a minute that that was very suspicious guys come on somebody uh oh evil Fred won. All right it's two to one, two to one Fred come on now don't let your king down. Doesn't matter what your mom's gonna think. It's gonna, I know it's gonna be tough around Thanksgiving this year. If you kill your brother. <laughs> but it's for Denmark. Three to one, right? Well, best out of five. I'm sorry, Evil Fred, you cannot win. There, done. All right, next suggestion was, there's another small battle. We're going to stick with Denmark because we're still in the Viking theme here. Uh, Fred. Let's get Fred back out here. Fred versus Big Andy. And this is terrible. Why would anyone want to put Fred versus his, his best childhood friend, Big Andy? I don't know. Well, let's see what happens here. Fred, listen, if you can kill your brother, you can kill your friend, Big Big Andy. You, you actually, you shot him. You killed him. Well, I guess you didn't kill him, technically, because he's back. But in the last episode... <laughs> Look at Big Andy. Big Andy. That Oh, Big Andy. He didn't appreciate that, Fred. Let's try that again. All right. Listen, just pretend he's an enemy. Barbarian. Yeah, yeah, from from uh, from France. That's good. Right, from France. Now throw it. Good. Now Big Andy's pretty big and tough. You got to get another one in there. Quickly. Oh. Uh, you're still up. Nice duck, Fred. Got it. <laughs> hey, this is what friends do. This is what guy friends do. Especially in Denmark. This is like, this is how they play. This is starts in preschool, right? Yeah, right. Starts you know, before preschool? That's crazy. Boom! Right in the... Uh, now, how do I slow it down? Oh, yeah, left mouse. All right, we're going to do a, a little slow-mo here. See if Fred can pull this off. Oh, man, the dive. Fred, you got to remember that dive attack that Andy uses. All right, what are we at? 2-2? Uh, two, two? Is that 2-2? Two, is that two and two? We're two and one. Oh my gosh, I lost count. Come on, Freddy. Just pretend he's your brother. He's easy to, to kill. Go again! Oh! 
Still alive. You gotta see when when Big Andy misses with oh, you gotta turn faster than that, Fred. Uh I guess that's it. Big Andy wins. He always wins. He's always beating on poor Fred. He's been doing that forever. So there you have it. Fred versus Big Andy. Can we keep going? Let's do one more. One more for old time's sake. Here he comes. You know, that Andy is a big fella, but he can still leap. Watch out. Oh, nice. Nice dodge. You gotta get him. I think he takes three spears. Fred. Oh. Fred. You can't win like... Oh. <laughs> right on the noggin. Donk. Alright, well. Fred, yeah, I think you won one. Did he win one or two? I think just one. All right, guys, this will be the last battle of the day. This is another suggestion. Let me put the screenshot up here in the comment. So this is the Avengers battle. So let's start with Captain America, who is a super boxer. And yeah, we're just going to scatter these around the map, I suppose. Uh, we have Hank Pym, giant man. He's a chicken man, man. And the chickens can be the si can be ant-sized soldiers. All right, let's get uh, Chicken Man Man. Where is Chicken Man Man? Chicken Man Man. Put him right here. He's giant. Nick Fury has an M16. Of course he does. Let's put him. Let's put him in the back. He's gonna have to move up front before he can start shooting because he is devastating with that thing. Scarlet Witch will be the dark peasant. Oh my. Yeah, we're gonna put her way in the back too. She is just going to wreck face. And what else do we have? Gamora is a samurai master. Oh, we just saw a whole bunch of these. Let's put Gamora here. And Star-Lord is a ninja master. Oh, dear Lord. Those guys are just ridiculous. Okay. Versus the army of... I didn't actually see the, uh, the latest Avengers, so I don't know. I guess it's the uh, Chitori army or something. I don't know. People, Ultron. Finally, I think we're ready to go. <laughs> Performance impact is very heavy. And the score is, um, well, not even close. So let's see what happens here. Oh, gosh. I'm staring at the ground. Here we go. Here go the Avengers. Go, Avengers, go. Uh, I forget who's who. Super boxers, Captain America. Punching the snot out of everybody. Taking down those farmers. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, here comes the Scarlet Witch. She's stabbing everybody. Here in front, the entire Chitauri soldier army is now dead. And where is she? Oh, she's just floating around, zapping everybody with her evil spikes. Oh, baby, look at that. Yeah, you don't want to let her get close to you, not the witch. We got uh, the uh, Pim, right? Uh, Chicken Man Man, Pim, Hank Pim. Sending his little ant army out. That's a good idea, ants. That's right. Get those, uh, who are these guys? The Chitari soldiers. The ants are all over them. <laughs> the Avengers are unstoppable. Man, wait, where's, um, where's Scarlet? Oh, no. Scarlet's down. What, wait, what killed her? Oh, the artillery. The artillery got her. This guy's dead, though. Look at, what she, look at the damage she did. She got this artillery guy right here. Stabbed him right through. And red victory. Do we win? The Avengers win! I think George Pym was the only... Uh, George. Um, Hank Pym was the only one left alive. That was, that was pretty interesting. I think the chicken man, man, chickens, is really did a number on this army, though. There's so many of them. I want to see... Um, where's Nick Fury? Oh, Nick Fury's over there behind the tree. He's just picking everybody off. He doesn't have to get close at all. I don't know what he's shooting at. I mean, they got a little tree cover here, which is helping. <laughs> Ooh, artillery coming in at you. Captain America's making a run for the artillery. Going behind the enemy lines. Punching the snot out of them all. Bang, bang, bang. Ooh. Oh, point blank. One of the Chitauri soldiers shot him right in the face. And it looks like Hank is going to be the only one left alive again. Oh, Scarlet's coming in. Ooh, Scarlet just took a shot from a stone, but she's still on her feet. Nick Fury is still firing 
furiously from the back there. <laughs> Here goes Scarlet going after the guy loading up another ball. He's trying to load up a rock. Couldn't quite make it. She caught up to him. Wow. That's pretty fun. I like the Avengers. All right, guys and gals, we're going to call it quits for now. Hope you enjoyed. And keep those suggestions coming, please. So in the comments of this particular video, give me some more scenarios that you like to see here in tabs. And, of course, when the Neon Faction comes out, we will be redoing the Star Wars Clone Wars battle for sure. With lightsabers, laser guns, and more. So I'm very excited about that. Anyway, take care. See you all next time. Bye-bye.